Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Game five in store for you tonight. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabolski. I'm looking forward to this. Yeah, you can just feel the buzz in this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening face-off. Every game critical in the postseason. This one no different, and we are underway. Musa quickly over to Barry, and it's a quick pass to Nurse. Handles the puck, and they'll go on the attack after that turnover. Standing tall with the save. We're still in the early stages of this period. The game is still scoreless. Edmonton's won the draw. Barry's moving the puck through his own zone. Stays with it. And that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. Up along the wing. Here's a short pass to Barry. That's blocked. Grabbed along the boards by Schmidt. Poked away in the offensive end. That's some smart heads up defensive play by Connor. Here's a chance up front. Stopped by the goaltender. Yeah, he gets out on top of the shooter. There's really nowhere for that puck to go. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Quick pass to Perfetti. Takes the feed. Great save by Smith. Keith's got it in the defensive end. Nice pass. Takes the feed from the left side. And no luck on that pass attempt. Moves it to Wheeler. That pass doesn't go. And he takes a shot. Glove save. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Hellebuck is a goalie that seems to get better the more shots he faces, guys. His workhorse zone ability means he can find his rhythm and make stop after stop as they keep coming his way. Nugent Hopkins has won the draw. Blocked aside. The Jets will play it from the defensive zone. Hawk moved over to Lowry. Couldn't complete the pass. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Cuts into the paint. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. This is always a fine line penalty. You're allowed a little interference, just not that much. Edmonton sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Scoreless game, power play gets their first opportunity. Man, I couldn't get on the ice quick enough for these, James. Winnipeg's got the puck in the defensive end. Sends it in on the attack. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. Tosses it on to Ryan. Gaining momentum along the wing. Can't connect on the pass. Oh, textbook poke check to turn that over. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Shoots it. Kicked away. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Ryan's at the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Edmonton's got it in the offensive zone. Looks to set up at the point now. Great poke check on the reach. And that's off a stick. Connect on the power play. That looked like a well-thought-out play. They moved the puck quickly found the open man, and it's in the net. Edmonton's got a quick goal here early in this first period, and with it, a different energy in this crowd. Everybody gets ramped up a little bit. You score early, you hope you can. Now you have, you go get another. Quick feed to Perlini. Takes the feed. Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. Let's it go. Turns it aside with a glove. Smith's on top of that for the whistle pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Ryan's rolling along on his point streak. You know he wants it to keep going. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Edmonton's ahead, 1-0.
Redirected! And he makes the stop with the glove to get a piece of it. Yeah, I hate it when I miss chances like this, James. You don't get many that are this quality. You want to put them away because you don't know when the next one's going to come. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Oilers have taken a 1-0 lead. Gustafson's won the draw. Edmonton's got control of it now from their own end. Pins them against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Musa quickly over to Clefbaum. And now he tries to get it across to Perlini. On the attack along the boards. Here's a short pass to Nash. The Oilers look to start the transition game. Quick pass to Yamamoto. Aaron pass and they can't connect. Tosses it to Nash. Takes it to the net. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Steps across the blue line. Taken by Morrissey. Into the attacking area from the left side. Edmonton's got the puck in their own end. Cuckoo stick handling in his own zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. There's the whistle. We got an offside. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Ryan's won it. Picked up along the boards by Barry. The Jets gain possession. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Takes a bump but hangs on to the puck. Moves it to Fogel. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Hellebuck. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Ehlers looks around. Great pressure with the stick. Puck battle along the boards. Great reach by Shifley. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Smith. Let's see what the officials are calling. I don't know that there's any time for an undisciplined penalty that could be a good one, but the one goal lead is definitely not it. The Jets will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. This power play almost jumped off the bench as soon as the penalty was called. They want out. They think they're the answer for the one goal deficit. And that's turned aside, brings the bell off the post. Winnipeg's players are frustrated as they have a really good scoring chance, but it hits the post and doesn't close the gap. Now a quick pass to Wheeler, and that pass can't connect. The Jets gain control of the puck against the wall. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Cops gaining momentum. Quick feed to Stastny. Moves around along the half wall. One-timer, and he comes up with the save. Effective use of the paddle on that one. Stuffs him again. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Just moments away from the resumption of this power play. They're ready to drop the puck here for this faceoff. Fires the one-timer. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Clefbaum. And that's a solid clearing attempt on the play. Winnipeg's got the puck behind the net. Here they come on the attack. Moves it quickly over to Shifley. Turned aside with the glove by Smith. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Ryan's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Edmonton's got it in the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Clefbaum. And they get the puck out of the defensive end. And that's poked away by Clefbaum. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Shifley. Oh, and a smart heads up play. He was locked in there. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Quick pass 
to Connor. And now he angles it across to Shifley. Barry's up and ready to join the play. Trying to clear the puck. Edmonton's PK unit comes up clutch. Well, there are times you look for your power play at the very least to gain a little momentum. They needed a goal. Now they still trail by one back to even strength. Puck picked up by Ehlers. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck now. And he passes it up ahead to Archibald. Puck dumped in. The Jets take possession in the defensive end. And serves up a little knock on the play. Takes it into the slot. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Really good work. I like this chance here as they get the puck into a scoring spot. Goalie's just better on this time. Oh, and that's got the crowd busting after that stop. And they won't connect on that one. Gets a hold of the puck behind the net. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. And things starting to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. Pass across to Ehlers. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Great read by Stasty. Pass back to the point. Right out front. He scores! They tie it up. They stay with it the entire time, Ray. I'm tired of listening to coaches talk about, oh, we followed the process. But the process is you don't get frustrated. You keep chipping away, and you hope to get to this point. Past the midway mark of the frame, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Here's a chance right in the slot, and he stands tall in goal. Goaltender covers it up, and we'll get a reset here. Centers glide into the dot as a face-off ready to resume play. Edmonton's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Makes the save on the slapper. The Jets take it along the wall. Edmonton's got the puck. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Here's a shot. Oh, how did he keep it out? What a blocker stop by Hillebuck. He was telling me this morning he worked on this in practice this week, making sure the puck goes to the corner and doesn't stay in the net. Hillebuck's got great technique and the athletic ability to backstop his team effectively. McDavid's wheel zone ability means he can move past everyone with his great skating speed. I'm expecting one of these two players to give their team the edge tonight. Guys, back to you. The Jets move the puck in the defensive zone. Takes the feed and he's got a step. Oh, what a save by the goaltender. Terrific play to get in all alone. The move and the shot look good to me, but the goalie is right on it. What a stop. Ryan's won it in their own end. And now it's over to Fogel. Pushes it across to Ryan. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Here he is, shot right in front. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. And sneaks in and grabs possession. Hangs onto the puck. And now he moves it to Perfetti. The Jets move to the offensive zone. Winnipeg's got possession at center. Tried to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. And here's a shot. Oh, just the wrong side of the post on that one. Trying to beat the goaltender with quickness, but it's wide of the target. And that one's broken up. Moves it to Polia. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Poked away in the defensive end. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. The Jets have it from their own end. Here they come up along the wing. Quick feed to Kopp. From point blank range. Oh, what a save in front. Back at the point, they set it up. 
Along the boards, they battled for the puck back and forth. And that's knocked away. Can't get it to go. And that one's stopped. Smith's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. Here in the late going of the frame, we are all tied up in this one. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. The Oilers will play it in their own end. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Hammers a shot, misses over the net. The Jets gain possession in their own end. Shot, shuts them down. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Face-off looming as both centers get into position. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Gustafson's picking up steam. And that pass goes off a stick. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. And he slides it quickly to Yamamoto. Edmonton's got the puck at center. And now it's grabbed by McDavid. Oh, the puck doesn't get there. It's so crowded in front of the goaltender. Taken by Morrissey. The Jets have it now. Puts it to the front of the net, and they can't finish that one. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that. The play was there. He just doesn't execute that last pass for the scoring opportunity. Moves it quickly over to Connor. Tries to the crease. Oh, that's a big time save. I think he got it with a toe. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. That's going to put a little stress on the end of this period here. Your penalty killers are going to have to do the job for you. Winnipeg's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Offense's own face off, and he wins the draw. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Sometimes you make a good shot, and you just get beaten by the goaltender. I'd say that's one that you put in that category. Receives the pass. Here's a shot. There's the horn, ending the first period. Both teams will have a chance to regroup. You do you, and we'll be back with period number two in a moment. are back at center ice and we are ready to get period number two underway. The Jets start the period off on the right note, winning the draw, and their man advantage unit gets going. And he comes up with it. Scrum ensues along the boards. Edmonton's got possession of the puck. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. Feeds it on over to Ehlers. Here's a short pass to Connor. And he makes the save. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Shifley's got a great shot, and the key to his accuracy is when he shoots the puck when it's settled down on the ice and not bobbling on him. That accuracy is what we call his snipe zone ability, guys. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Trying to clear the zone. And a nice job by the killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice and tries to make a diagonal pass to Ehlers. Here's a chance, and makes the save. Nice job to escape the zone. Taken along the wall by Clefbaum. The Jets have it now. Slides the puck to Clefbaum. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. Hyman's got it into offensive territory. Picked up along the wall by Clefbaum. Ehlers setting up against the wall. And that one's turned away. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. They score! And they jump in front after executing perfectly on the man advantage. I thought they looked terrific when they went out on the ice. 
oftentimes you draw up the power play and it just doesn't quite work the way you want to. They pursued a plan, they executed it perfectly, and now they've got the lead. Winnipeg's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. The Jets ready to go on the attack. Winnipeg's got a hold of it along the wall. Stopped by the goaltender. Smith's gonna slow things down and up for the whistle. Well, you gotta kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Still plenty of time left in this frame. The Jets are looking to build on this one goal lead. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Smith's gonna cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Both centers ready to take the draw here coming up. The frozen biscuits dropped and we are back underway here. Gains the zone through the middle. Poked away by Lowry. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Back to the point it goes. And gets a piece of him with the trapper. Hellebuck's going to elect for the face-off and maybe just a chance to play with the puck a little. Well, you get to feel it for sure, but he hasn't had much to do at all. His team's been in control as they lead this game. Winnipeg's got possession here in their own end. The Jets have it behind the net. Gaining momentum along the wing. Quick pass to Dubois. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Smith. The Oilers have continually put themselves in good positions defensively tonight. It seems like every shift they're stealing a puck. Perfetti's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. His reflexes on display tonight. Scrum along the boards. The Oilers gain control of the puck. Here they come inside the neutral zone. And uses the length of a stick to knock that puck away. Rips it! And that goes off a player. Moves it to Wheeler. Comes up with the stop. Nurse has got the puck in his own zone. The Oilers take it along the wall. And that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. Quick feed to Barry. And no luck on that pass attempt. Can't get it to go. Winnipeg's got it in their own zone. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Schmidt. Scooped up along the wall by Dillon. Puck sent over to Veselainen. Into the offensive zone. The Oilers look to start the transition game. That pass doesn't go. Play whistle dead offside the call. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Jets are clinging to a 2-1 lead. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Hyman's lugging the puck. Musa quickly over to Cuckoo. The Jets have it against the wall. Couldn't complete the pass. Moves the puck. Here's a short pass to Hyman. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Dumps it into the other end. Winnipeg's got a hold of it against the wall. Niku's taking it from his own end. Moving into the attacking zone. Into the corner now. And that's knocked aside with the stick by Keith. Thunderous collision along the wall. Winnipeg's got a hold of it against the wall. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Edmonton's got control of it now from their own end. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. And that's off a stick. Steps inside. Let's it fly, and makes the save. Quick pass to Shifley. Oh, and he misfires on that. Takes the pass. Dreisaitl's got it in the offensive zone. Saucer pass. 
And now he moves it quickly to Barry. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck now. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Moves it to Ehlers. Cut into the front of the net. Oh, and it stays out. I think he made a toe save on that one. Can't connect on the pass. Winnipeg's got the puck along the wall. Oh, that sounded like a car crash. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Delayed penalty coming up here. Whistle stops the play. Oh, you can see the frustration right away, James. Short-handed now and only a one-goal lead. Edmonton's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Great opportunity to get this game back to level a power play, trailing by one. This is a huge opportunity. And the puck clears the zone. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Quick feed to pull the Scores! And we're tied just like that! When the power play comes through big, you get a special team's opportunity. You can't let it slide when you're trying to make a big impact on this current game. The power play scores, the game is tied, and we've got a whole new game to look at. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Great defensive effort with the stick. Taken along the wall by Puyo Yarby. And they continue to apply pressure here. And now he tries to get it across to Dubois. The Jets play it along the boards. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by CeCe. Edmonton's got the puck inside the defensive zone. The Oilers will play it in their own end. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. Ryan's got the green light to try this move almost anywhere on the ice. The coaches have great faith in his ability, but he just can't complete it. Oh, they'll be forced to start over from center as the puck leaves the zone. And now he angles it across to Stastny. Aaron pass, and they can't connect. Sends a pass over. Takes a shot. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? Moves it quickly over to Dillon. Hellebuck's got to be checking the clock here, wondering if the thing's ticking at all, because the puck's in his end the whole time. He's been super busy. Here's a short pass to Perfetti. And he denied that opportunity. Quick pass to Ryan. And that pass can't connect. Can't get it to go. Moves it over to DeMello. And they won't connect on that one. Moves it to Stastny. The Oilers take possession in the defensive end. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck. Intercepted. Play is called for offside. More than half the frame has been played here. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Oilers win the faceoff. Directs it on over to Perry. Tried to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. Dumps it into the Ozone. The Jets gain possession along the wall. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Picking up some steam at center ice. There's a hit on the play. Here's a shot. That's gloved by Smith. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play. If you're not sure what's going on, freeze the puck. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Shifley's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Edmonton's got the puck. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. The Oilers take over on possession. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Quick feed to Dreisaitl. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. And he makes a save on that play. Oh, and it's another save on the play.
in the final moments of this period. It's all tied up. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Takes a shot. Score! Now you got the lead. Don't sit back. Get right back to the face off and try and attack again. The Oilers set up back at center, now up by one. A long time coming. You work hard to get yourself into the position to lead. Now you want to start the third period with this lead. Edmonton's got the puck in their own end. Dishes it to Barry. Feeds it over to McDavid. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And that doesn't exactly go tap to tape. Moves it quickly over to CeCe. Keeps control of the puck after taking a little knock. Morrissey's got control of it now behind the cage. Couldn't find the intended target. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. And no luck on that pass attempt. The Jets have it against the wall. And that's poked away by Dreisaitl. Dishes it to Pugliarvi. Tries to get it over to McDavid. The Jets move it in. Here he is from the slot. Denies him in front. Picked up along the wall by Perfetti. Pinned up along the boards. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Sends the pass over. Scooped up along the wall by Keith. Good read with the stick to break that up. Puck grab by Keith. And he slides it quickly to Hyman. Gains the zone from the right. Drives it to the crease. And he's peeling off to regroup. The Jets have it from their own end. Grabbed along the board by Wheeler. And he regains control of the puck. The Oilers have it now. Here's a short pass to Ryan. Second frame almost done. Well inside a minute now. Quick pass. He scores! That's three in a row! This is turning into an onslaught. There seems to be no way to slow them down. Edmonton's looking to preserve this two-goal lead right to the intermission. Well, they'd love to get it in the spot that they're in, and then guaranteed the coaches will talk about there's still 20 minutes left. Stay after it. And that's poked away. Looks to get the puck over to Stastny. Great poke check on the reach. Slides the puck across to Morrissey. Moves it to Lowry. Winnipeg's got the puck against the half wall. Slides it across to Cassian. And that concludes the second period of play. Still one more period of regulation time. We'll see what happens in the third next.
dead center and moves forward. Pod save. He's on it tonight. Smith's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Winnipeg still down a goal here, but they have really picked up the tempo these last few minutes. Dubois got it along the wing. Edmonton's got possession of the puck. Makes a move in front. Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. Throws it in. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. Winnipeg's got it now. Oh, it's a game of inches. And it went the wrong way. Man, for the shooter it did. He doesn't get it on the net. For the goalie, that's perfect. He'll tell you he took away the entire net, and there's nowhere to shoot. Quick pass to Dubois. Edmonton stained possession. Ryan's had the puck in his hands a great deal tonight. He's got a couple of points, and he's looking for more as he jumps back on the ice. That's a solid check on the play. Sends it over to Barry. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. The Jets look to start the transition game. We got a penalty coming up here. Quick whistle stops the play. That penalty really puts them back on their heels here. Even though they got the one goal lead, now you've got to defend it short of man. The Jets send their man advantage unit out once more. You never know when your opportunities are going to show up here to tie the game. Well, I don't know if a power play can be any bigger of a chance than that. And he gets just enough of it to keep it out from the back of the net. And they send it down the ice. Winnipeg's got the puck along the wall. The Oilers have it in the offensive zone. Winnipeg's looking to break out. Slides the puck over. From the slot, wrist shot, scores! And we're tied with a little special in special teams. Well, the power play comes through for them. They were working on it in the morning skate, trying to get the puck from the point to the front of the net with a little more traffic, but that's just one variation. Here they're able to score, the game's tied, and we now have a whole new game to look at. Cops gonna play it against the half wall. Maintains possession. Denies him on the play. Handles the puck. Skates to the crease. Oh, what a stop as he uses his paddle to swat it away. And that's knocked away by Yamamoto. Moves it to Lowry. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Quick feed to Dreisaitl. The Jets gain possession in their own end. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. The Jets take it along the wall. Puck battle along the boards. Take it along the wall by Kleppbaum. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. With possession along the wall. Great read with the stick. The Oilers scoop it up along the boards. Edmonton's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. They score! Ray, I don't know how many times we've traveled around. You always talk about it's better to play in front. Well, you break the deadlock here, James. Now you get out in front. You can dictate the pace of the game. Guys, he's got great balance. And here on this play, he maintains possession after being bumped by defenders. He ends up scoring the goal because of that determination and strength, which is his unstoppable force superstar ability. Takes the feed. Winnipeg's got the puck against the half wall. Nice pass. The Oilers take it across the line. Takes the feed at the point. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Here's a chance! Oh, aggressive move as he pokes it away! Wide of the net. He's got to do something a little better than that. Just can't finish it from there. Wonder if that gives him a nightmare later. The Jets are in transition. Read perfectly with the stick at center by Ryan. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Dumps it in. Manages to hang on. 
Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Here he is, wrists it on net. Picked up along the boards by Shifley. Fails to find the open man. Moves it over to Clefbaum. Edmonton's got it into the offensive zone. Centering pass. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. Oh, and stops him again. Quick reflexes and good positioning to make a couple of stops in a row. Still lots of time left here in this frame. Edmonton's been the better looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one goal lead. Here's a short pass to Nugent Hopkins. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Morrissey. Nice speed at center, moves up ahead now. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Connor's able to take that quick pass. He's already got a couple of goals. He's looking for a third. Scrum ensues along the boards. The Oilers move it ahead. And it's a quick pass to Nurse. Slides the puck over to Perry. That pass doesn't go. Denied by the puck stopper. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Well past the midway mark of this period. Edmonton's leading by one. They're up 5-4. Winnipeg's won the draw. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Here's a shot. How did he stop that one? They worked the puck into a scoring spot. Get a pretty good chance on goal. They just can't find a way to finish it off. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Along the half wall with the puck. Stays with it. Slapped away by the blocker. Takes the puck along the boards. Oh, wow! Stops him again! Why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop. Now he's got to be sharp to make another. Who had the edge? Carlin's standing by with the answer. Nick David's got my vote here tonight, guys. I know he hasn't recorded any points, but I still like how he's competed and stayed engaged. Winnipeg's got it against the boards. Here's a shot, and there's the save. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Feeds it down low. And that's just out of reach. Takes the feed. Slides the puck down low. The Oilers have it against the wall. Picked up along the wall by Keith. Over the line they come. Winnipeg's got control of it now from their own end. And that's a great hits up play in the offensive zone. Passes it over to Wheeler. Through center along the wing. From the left side it moves to the middle of the ice. Along the boards they battle for the puck back and forth. Now a quick pass to Dillon. Here's a shot with the stop. Smith's going to slow things down and opts for the whistle. He's had a really good night. He's been on top of his game, and there's not been much that's given him trouble. Here in the back half of this period, it's a one-goal hockey game in what has been a fantastic display of offense. It's 5-4. And he slides it quickly to Stastny. And that pass is redirected. Couldn't complete the pass. The Oilers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Great reach with the poke check by CeCe. Receives the pass. Edmonton's been talking about trying to have more depth scoring throughout their lineup. Well, they're getting it tonight. And what they're really getting is a top-rate performance from their depth players. Gets the puck over to Ryan. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Can't find his man. Moves it quickly over to CeCe. Great heads up play to poke it away in the offensive end. Moves it around along the half wall. And that's picked off in front. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Edmonton's got the puck in their own end. Here they come up along the wing. Now the best defense is to play some offense as well. This is a smart play. With the lead, he dumps it into the corner. Now he can forecheck a little bit, try to kill some clock. Slides it diagonally to Turris. 
He scores! And we're all tied up right here in the third. Well, you can never quit. Keep plugging away. You look for that tying goal. They got it now. When he shoots the puck while on the move, he has such a quick release that it's hard to stop, guys. That's his make it snappy superstar ability. And just look at how quickly this one went into the cage. Puck picked up by Hyman. Quick pass to DeMello. The Oilers have it in the offensive end. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck now. Inside the offensive zone. Hyman's got it in the defensive end. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. The Jets have been handed two for interference. And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. Most power plays I was on, James, we were all greedy. If you had one or two earlier in the game, you wanted three or four. It never lays down. Can't connect on the pass. Edmonton's got the puck in the defensive end. Slides it to Dreisaitl. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Winnipeg's got it behind the net. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. The Oilers gain control of the puck. Edmonton's looking to break out of their own end. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Gets it over to Nugent Hopkins. Trying to engage a little physicality here. And they clear that puck. The Oilers have it against the wall. Can't connect. The Jets will play the puck from behind the net. Aaron pass and they can't connect. Works it across to Ryan. Driving right to the front. There's another stop. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Lowry's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Edmonton's got it and they're on the attack. Blocked in traffic. Looking to get it out. And that's a big clear at this stage of the game. Yeah, they're all big now. You, that puck's near the blue line. It's got to get out. Gains the zone through center. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. They go on the attack from the left side. And that pass can't connect. Oh, what a stop. The Oilers have it now. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Moves it to Lowry. Gets it out of his own end. Shifley's time is almost done. Nearing the final minute of regulation. Edmonton's power play comes up empty-handed. We're back to even strength on the ice. That's a big swing and a miss right there for the power play. Critical moment of the game, and they're not able to cash in. Quick feed to Hyman. On the doorstep, and that one's broken up. Here's a short pass to Wheeler. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. From the slot, wrist shot, and that's blocked. The Oilers take it along the wall. McDavid stick handling in his own zone. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. Let's be honest, this isn't the best of news. A penalty this late in a tie game. Winnipeg special teams have another big opportunity to deliver here. The Jets win the faceoff. He scores! That's the hat trick! Oh, what a great feeling to get three goals in a game. Doing it on the road is a, is a real nice trick. Both teams readying here for the faceoff. Puck is dropped, play resumes. Scooped up along the wall by Ehlers. Moves it quickly over to Archibald. There's another for the hit parade. Edmonton's trailing, that's why they've got the extra attacker out on the ice and the goalie on the bench. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain.
Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Scores! We're tied! We're tied! We're tied here late in the game! What a shocking, shocking goal to go in so late in the game. This looked like it was under control. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. Big stop just as time expires in the period. And there's the buzzer. 60 minutes have been played, and we are still tied. Let's go to overtime, and we'll do that next here on EA Sports. Are you hashtagging overtime challenge on social media? Because they're ready to get it underway. The puck is dropped. Next goal wins. No one home on that play. Great defensive effort with the stick. And he handles the cross ice pass. Winnipeg's got the puck inside the defensive zone. The Jets have it now. Taken by Schmidt. And now it's over to Shifley. And they turn it over in the neutral zone. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Winnipeg's got the puck along the wall. Pinned up along the boards. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Quick pass to Barry with the stop. Taken along the wall by McDavid. Keeps hold of the puck. Poked away. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. The Jets gain control of the puck against the wall. And the puck leaves the zone. They'll be forced to regroup at center. He grabs the puck here at the point. Denies him with the pad. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. And some good footwork to kick it away. Grabs the puck in the corner. Edmonton's got it along the wall. Tries to get it out of harm's way. Across the line. Sends it ahead to Pugliarvi. Gains the zone on the left wing. Moves it to Nugent Hopkins. Gets in front of it. Looks to pass it to Wheeler. Now he takes it over the line. The Jets gain possession along the wall. Quick feed to Dubois. Battle along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Hyman. The Jets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Passes the puck over to Nugent Hopkins. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. And they fail to go tape to tape. And that's broken up. Here's a chance in front. Oh, that's a smart heads up play as he breaks it up with the poke. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Here's a short pass to Clefbaum. Answers it with an even better save. Hellebuck's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. The setters will glide into the dot. The Oilers win the draw. Nothing doing on that. The Jets have it against the wall. Cops moving the puck through his own zone. Lowry's got it against the boards. Let's it go! Misses high! That feels like a wasted opportunity. You gotta get it. Game on a stick! Oh, what a save to keep it tied! Sends it over to Cassian. Quick pass to Cop. The Oilers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Still keeps a hold of it. Great poke by Stasny. The Jets scoop it up along the boards. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. And that's turned aside. Nice zone entry from the middle. Centering pass. Makes the save as he gets a piece of it with the glove. Dished on over to Lowry. The Jets looking against the half wall. And that's picked off in front. 
The Oilers are on the attack. The Jets gain possession. Winnipeg's got it in their own zone. Moves it quickly over to Lowry. Quick shot. That's kicked away with the pad by Smith. Sends it in deep. The Jets have it behind the cage. And now he moves it to Lowry. Picked off. Tried to be too cute on the pass. Scooped up along the wall by Nurse. Gains control of the puck here at the blue line. The Oilers play it near the point. From one point man to another. Move to the middle. Can't capitalize on the play. The Jets have the puck now. Takes the pass. Moves the puck. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. And a stick break set up. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. The Oilers will play it in their own end. On the attack along the boards. Moves it to Yamamoto. For the win! And he comes up with a huge save! And he can't find his man. Knocked away in the offensive zone. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Takes a wrist shot. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Sends a pass over. Here's a shot. The blocker saved by Smith. Couldn't connect on that pass. Quick feed to Lowry. For the win. And he keeps it alive. What a stop. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. The Jets take possession off the face-off. Handles the puck at the point. Connor's going to play it against the half wall. Edmonton's got the puck. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Grabbed along the boards by CeCe. Great forecheck by Shifley. Oh, and it stays out with the toe save. Smothered that in close chance. And now it's grabbed by Ehlers. Here's a short pass to Dreisaitl. Makes his presence known on the ice. Made the stop on that play. Make the save, help yourself out at the same time. Good stop, but the better part is that he gets the puck away from the front of the net. Quick pass to Shifley. Comes up with the blocker save. Sends the pass over. Slides the puck to Barry. And now he moves it quickly to McDavid. Slides the puck over. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Scrum along the boards. Taken along the wall by Puyo Yarby. And there's a power play opportunity coming up here. Whistle blows, stopping the play. Everything is magnified in overtime. This penalty is crucial to the outcome of this game. Edmonton's got a huge opportunity on this power play. Oh, you can feel the buzz now. Here's the power play in overtime, and they got a great chance to put this away. Puck grab by Bullia. And they get the puck out. The Oilers have it against the wall. And they'll go on the attack after that turnover. Takes it right in the chest. And there's the whistle giving him a chance to exhale. Lowry's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. The Jets will go to work here in the offensive zone. Oh, what a stop by Smith. Tough enough to make the save unless you can see it. He's got to fight his way and find the puck. Takes the feed. Denies him with the pad. Hellebuck's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, if he covers it up to kill the play. Ryan's ready for the draw on this man advantage. Edmonton's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Denied by the goaltender. Winnipeg's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. And they get that puck down the ice. Edmonton's got possession of the puck. Takes the return feed. Moves it quickly over to Pugliarvi. Oh, what a save 
saved by Hillebuck. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Gustafson's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. Fantastic save! Hellebuck sharp to make that stop. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Let's get the call. I could hear the frustration right away as soon as that call was made. A door slam, a stick smashed on the ground. They'll go right back to work here on the power play. What an opportunity. The coaches are saying on the bench as they went out again, it's another chance. Put this thing away. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to pull the army. They fight for it along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Barry. Looking to end it. Oh, we are still tied. What a stop. Puck clears the zone. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. Moves it to Hyman. The Oilers carry it along the wall. Here he is in close. Turn that one aside. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a faceoff? The Oilers win it. Hammers the shot. No room for that one to get through. There it is. There it is. They score to win it in overtime. And this one is all over as the final horn sounds. Ray, what do you make of that pushback tonight? I loved it. I thought there were a couple of times they were up on two wheels, but they were able to fight through and get themselves into the series. Now they trail three to two. I guess there's a lot of different organizations that can take credit for how this grassroots movement started, but I love the post-game tip of the cap here. Well, I think any team that doesn't do it now would look like they're missing the boat. My name is James Sabalski, and on behalf of Ray Ferraro, thanks so much for hanging out with us. What an intense evening from this playoff atmosphere.